Install a spool of PLA, polylactic acid plastic, and feed the PLA filament through the extruder. What we're going to do is we're going to install a new reel of PLA. Um, so then once we're going to, we're going to feed it through the extruder assembly. There are many different colors of PLA and there's many other types of materials we can use with 3D printers such as ABS, brass, rubber, metal, carbon fiber infused plastic, and even chocolate. So our first step is to open the lever, cam lever. We're gonna open it, it's just gonna to be to the left. So this is usually uh, tight pressing down. We're gonna open it up, release the pressure. Next, we're gonna come down to our controller. We're gonna press on the knob on the controller. We're gonna turn the control wheel down to uh, prepare. And then we're going to press the knob and we're going to uh, scroll the wheel down till we get the preheat PLA. We're going to press the knob in. And now I'm going to turn the wheel back to the left. I'm going to go all the way back up to main, press, and then I'm going to press again and watch. And I'm going to watch the temperatures. Over here, this is the PLA temperature. It's already at 199 of 200, and the bed temperature is is uh, 81 it's set to be 80. So at this point our PLA is warmed up. So after we've done that now we can uh, pull this wire out. We're going to need a pair of pliers and we're going to have to grab a hold of it with the pliers and we're going to grab a hold of it really tight with the pliers we're going to pull it up and you can see it pulls out. I keep a hold of the, of the of the PLA. I like to clip off the end at the very end here so we can clip it off so we have a clean uh, clean reel. And you want to keep up the whole of the, uh, of the reel. I'm going to reel it up. I have this uh, piece of cloth you want to take off and carefully do not drop this onto our mirror glass. When we take it off we want to place uh, this through a hole, right? So we're going to just place it through a hole so it doesn't unwind. And now we have done step one, which is to remove the existing reel of our PLA plastic. Install a reel of PLA plastic on the reel assembly. So we're going to remove this reel from the sealed container, uh, which we already have and the sealed container will have a packet of desiccant in it because this PLA absorbs moisture so we don't want to leave it out. Um, next is we want to make sure the filament is not tangled so we want to make sure that this is not looped or anything like that so uh, it's free to unwind. Okay. Uh, then I like to take some compressed air and I like just to blow off any dust. If we get a little bit of dust in here, it goes and jams up our filament feed path. Now, once I have that done, I'm going to take the filament off. And it's, it goes through a hole, but this has now been kinked. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to clip this off. Okay? So I have a nice reel of without any kinks in it. I'm going to place it up on the reel assembly, being careful not to uh, drop it on the heated bed plate. I'm going to go through the hole up here. So I go through the hole and I pull it down and then I can stick the filament into the hole of the extruder, into the feed path. And uh, so I'm going to put it down in there and I push it down quite a bit. It goes down like over an inch. Make sure it's down all the way. Then I'm going to take my fancy cloth here and you can see how the dirt has been on that cloth cleaning that off. I'm just going to fold it to a new piece of cloth and I'm going to wrap it around the PLA plastic and I'm going to use this office binder and I'm going to bind it and have it above the hole in the, the reel assembly. Now once I'm done with that, I'm going to close 
all, uh, the cam lever. And that, uh, that now we installed the uh, PLA up. Step four is to extrude some filament. So first we're going to press down on the knob, we're going to spin it, and we're going to go to um, control, or excuse me, prepare rather. We're going to go to prepare. I'm going to press the knob down, then I'm going to spin it down and spin it down, and I'm going to go all the way down to move axes. And then I'm going to press the knob. Now I'm going to spin it down to, to the bottom of the screen to extrude. I'm going to press the knob. As I hold the knob down, I'm going to extrude some PLA. All right. And so the PLA will start to extrude. As I'm holding the extrude button down, it will force the PLA to extrude down through the down through the nozzle. 